to me, the most obvious benefit of doing things this way is to counter any kind of dis- disillusionment that happens when people join the movement. Uh, for a lot of us, it's happened like we started off like that, thinking, you know, is this is this why we signed up for it? Uh, why aren't we happy? Uh, why are we so overworked? Why are we burned out? Why is there no motivation? And you know, the kind of work we do, the kind of oppressive structures that we fight every single day it's not it's not a day job to be an activist right it happens all the time it's such a personal battle uh, particularly the feminist struggle is such a personal battle so um you know you need these benefits to stay sane you need these benefits to not be skeptical and cynical about how things are shaping up because let's face it the world is filled with a lot of bad news and we're trying our best to see the silver lining, we're trying our best to focus on the good, we're trying our best to focus on the happy part of it. So we need to be physically and mentally strong uh, every single day in our jobs, in our work, in the field, so that you know we counter all of these oppressive uh, uh, forces. So yeah, I mean, at the most obvious level, I, I would you know, advocate for these benefits to just stay sane uh, in the movement. And we need that because we don't want people to leave for this reason that, you know, it's not giving me happiness or it's making me feel tired because that's, that's just heartbreaking for, to see people leave for that reason.